and a warm welcome to Wigginton Road, York. We're, uh, we're here for the first round of the John Player Trophy, where York entertain uh, St. Helens. Sates first out on the pitch now, feeling uh, the same team that uh, annihilated Salford at Nosey Road last Sunday. I'll just go through the Saints team for you now. Number one, O'Connor. Two, Carrington. Three, Tanner. Four, Lachlan. Five, Quirk. Six, Cooper. Seven, Bluer. Eight, Burke. Nine, Dwyer. Ten, Evans. Eleven, Farber. Twelve, Haggerty. Thirteen, Barton. Substitutes for Saints. Fourteen, Beavers. And fifteen, Allen. It's a capacity uh, crowd here at York, or should I say an all-ticket match. It's uh, 3,100 capacity, as uh, made by the local uh, police. But out come the York side now. A tremendous support from the Saints here at Wigginton Road. Plenty of red and white. It's uh, just uh, 3,100, but uh, there's uh, seven coaches at least to come from St Helens, plus all those with cars. Today's referee is uh, Mr Steve Cross from Hull. The York team, I'll just go through them for you now. Number one, Wigglesworth. Two, St John Ellis. Three, Jeff Price. Four, Chris Macklin Shaw. Five, Darren St Hilaire. Six, Gary Atkins. Seven, Steve Dobson. Eight, Ian, Ian Paver. Nine, Stuart Horton. 10, Ian Fletcher, 12, Graham Sullivan, uh, 11, Graham Sullivan, I beg your pardon, 12, Paul Mulherin, 13, Steve Bleakley, with substitutes for York, at number 14, Nick Waters, and 15, Steve Wheatley. That's the 18th season of the John Player Trophy, since so uh, the holders of the trophy. I'll remember that uh, classic final at Wigan last season, where... Uh, Saints beat Leeds by 15 points to 14. Away we go, Paul Lachlan kicks off. Saints playing up to the scoreboard end for the first half of this match. Obviously with uh, York uh, not being one of the Saints uh, regular opponents and with York playing away from the scoreboard end from uh, our commentary position, we might have a little bit of difficulty picking out uh, the York players, but uh, obviously we do our best. But it's York in possession. Solid tackling from the Saints to Vartin and Farber. Well, uh, referee cross in straight away. Penalises the Saints uh, for not allowing the York player to get up and play the ball. But in his opinion, of course. But uh, as long as he's uh, consistent with these uh, decisions and uh, for both teams, uh, we'll have no complaints. Anyway, York kicks over to the uh, far side stand. Fine touch, 10 yards short of the halfway line. Stuart Horton, the ex Castleford hooker, to uh, restart play. Darren Bluer, Paul Vaulting quickly in there, completing the tackle while the ball goes down. It's going to constitute a knock on. Unfortunately, Saints couldn't uh, capitalise on that loose ball there. First scrum of the match, just uh, midway between the York 25 and the halfway line. Darren Blewett to feed. Saints come up with the ball, but uh, York are penalised for an infringement at the scrum. Differential penalty. Paul Lachlan. One uh, noticeable absentee in the York uh, programme pen pitches. But Bernard Dwyer onto Stuart Evans. Saints crowd come alive now, get behind the favourites. Tony Birkin now receiving the ball, drives upfield. Three and four man York tackle, get in there, force him back. Dwyer again, Bluer, crossfield. Shane Cooper back to Bluer, short ball to Farber. Saints keep it going, Farber brought down just short of the uh, York 25. Paul Vartin now, straightens up. Drives towards the York line. Bernard Dwyer at uh, acting half back for the Saints. Farber goes left. Coming through from deep, Paul Farber. It's the last tackle now for the Saints. Shane Cooper. Diagonal kick. Obviously, plan move there. But uh, the ball uh, allowed to run dead. 
That's it, it's right wing partnership there, perhaps uh, of Carrington and Tanner. Good shock in possession, reached out with a 25 yard tap. Taking the ball right. Tony Burke and Bernard Dwyer. Bernard Dwyer having a, an extended run in the hooker's role with the injury to Paul Groves. Rich York still in possession. Making ground 10 yards now from the halfway line. Saints moving up very quickly. Pushing the defence uh, with the York attack back, I should say. Back to scrub half, uh, Steve Dobbs, I think. He kicks up field. No problem. Michael O'Connor takes it. Les Quirk looms up on his right. O'Connor going on his own. Tremendous run from O'Connor. This uh, manly and Australian uh, centre. Well, centre come full back, come half back. When he's days with St George, he's played at standoff and uh, no doubt uh, played in all the back positions. But it's Saints now, still in possession. Blue returns it inside to Barton. Cooper comes up with that ball. Take it well. Paul Barton going from back in half back position. Just penetrates the York half now. Dwyer at dummy half. To Cooper, loop movement with Bluer. Cooper still going, sees the gap. Short ball to Tanner. But uh, York penalised, it's uh, number three, Jeff Price, going in uh, with what uh, a referee cross uh, is indicating as like a, a stiff arm or an elbow. A raised arm. Saints are awarded the penalty. <laughs> Lachlan finds touch just outside the York 25. Bernard Dwyer plays it onto Tony Burke. Saints moving centre field. Burke finally allowed to play it up to uh, Stuart Evans. Coming through from deep. But Saints driving upfield. Valuable 10 15 yard burst from Evans. Loop movement here from the Saints. Cooper, Carrington. Carrington in field with uh, Tanner on his outside and uh, Michael O'Connor. O'Connor now in uh, blue and now she's across to Haggerty. Oh, he's taken on Haggerty, still stood up, gets the ball free onto Bernard Dwyer. Well, all action this man, Haggerty. Takes two and three players with him, releases the ball, keeps the ball alive. Vaulting now, it's actually half back. The judge to have knocked on the from the acting halfback position. So a scrum down, just about 20 yards from the York try line. Steve Dobson to feed, but uh, the ball come out Saints side, but Dobson uh, allowed to get it. possession, bringing it to the left. The York forwards there, straightening up and driving upfield. Steve Dobson there, trying to get uh, a plan move for York. They're swinging it now to the right. Ball forward, one of the tattlers in there with uh, Bernard Dwyer, I think it is, on that side. It's the sixth tattle for York. Back to Dobson, but taken comfortably by uh, Michael O'Connor. Coming cross field, chip through, chase is on. Full back uh, Wigglesworth, but a super tackle from O'Connor. He was slightly impeded in his uh, way through there. But uh, Wigglesworth did uh, get the ball, O'Connor tackled him, but Mike Carrington there penalised for being in an offside position. Had to play the ball. So it's York with this penalty, just 10 yards inside their own half. <coughs> Kicking up uh, onto the main stand area here at St Wiggington Road. Stuart Orton to restart play, York moving it to the right. First time they've been in the Saints half, just uh, seven and a half minutes play. Gone, it's Stuart Hartnell's acting half back for York. Moving it right onto Dobson. Farber and uh, Evans there in the tackle. Solid tackling from the Saints. 
Morton again. Not two of Dobson, obviously the uh, York player revolves around these men. It's number five winger here, Darren St. Hilaire. He's had the ball inside, but it's hit his eighth player and went into touch. Well, scrum down on the Saints 25. It's going to be uh, a York feed with Steve Dobson. To feed, referee Cross trying to get the pack uh, packed into some kind of formation. Well, feeding there. Dobson penalised for feeding. He's uh, remonstrating with the referee. But the referee Cross takes uh, no further action. Paul Lachlan steps up. For the added yardage from the penalty, Pines touch 10 yards short of the halfway. Stewart Evans coming through at pace. Brought down right on the halfway line, Bernard Dwyer taking up the acting half back position. Saints moving left. Tony Burke now. Quick hands across field. Out to Saints, Percy backs, and I'm sure this will pay dividends. Cooper now. Out to Farber. Stood up in the tackle, Farber looking to release. Finally. Uh, Two more York tattlers come in and complete the, uh, the tattle. Cooper, Vaughton, inside ball now to uh, Darren Bluer. Down to David Tanner, <laughs> but the ball uh, being knocked on. Darren Bluer and David Tanner, they're just getting uh, mixed up. But it's a scrum down, just uh, 10 yards inside the Saints half. Steve Dobson to feed. So it's just have to uh, settle down and play the uh, open rugby, the fame for. Obviously, York are going to try and uh, take them off the game. But it's Dobson to feed. York come up with the ball. Dobson again. Obviously, it's this uh, Dobson uh, Stuart Horton partnership that uh, York are pinning the hopes on this afternoon. Steve Blinkley uh, feeds the ball right. One of three uh, Australians in the York line up today. Big prop forward, uh, Ian Fletcher. As York now spread it to the left. Not a lot of atmosphere in this um, main stand here, not until uh, Saints touch the ball, that is. You can tell uh, York are in possession at present. But the ball going back uh, to number 11, uh, Graham Sullivan. Grubbers downfield. Nice quirk. Has it uh, covered comfortably. Takes it on his own line. Runs crossfield, tries to straighten up now. <coughs> Gains 10, 15 yards in natural uh, forward uh, momentum. David Tanner from acting halfback. Obviously, Saints uh, will have to uh, spread it out if they can. Spread it out wide as uh, to the pacey backs. So Played it up the middle at present. A few forward drives, but it'll have to be uh, spread out. Stuart Evans now at acting halfback. On to Haggerty. Diagonal run from Haggerty turns inside to Paul Vartin. Feeds well. Vartin driving upfield. Australian uh, loose forward Steve Bleakley brings him down. But the ball's released. Dwyer over to Les Quirk on the left wing for Saints. Brought down just short of the halfway line. Saints now in possession. Farber attacks in half back. Saints bring it right now. Solid tackling uh, from York there. Uh, Sullivan and uh, Bleakley bring him down. Lachlan, rubbers for touch. Well, just uh, hit uh, Darren Sintelaer. He manages to uh, recover the ball. Mike Carrington and David Tanner say trike wing partnership quickly in there. Now on to uh, Jeff Price. Dobson now. Acting half back. Taking the ball right. Bleakley though. The loose forward for York. Tony Burke wins him down. Dobson again. Saints penalised uh, for offside. Moving up too quickly at uh, the play of the ball. So, uh, York going to have a go for a goal. That's number 11, it looks like. Uh, Graham Sullivan. Well, as I said before, Saints defending the uh, hold on the John Player trophy. Reed leads uh, in the final uh, last year, 15 points to 14 at Wigan. First round of this uh, John play today, and away tie at York. 
Oh, well, see, it's three, uh, the first uh, three ties in the jump player last season were at home. So he's lucky in that respect, even though it was against uh, formidable opposition. But it's Sullivan lining up, centre field, 45 yards out. Looks like it's gone over to the left, but Michael O'Connor takes it. Drives upfield, shoulder in and down. As uh, number 12, Paul Mulherin comes in to complete the tackle. And York this time penalised for offside. Five yards is the required distance, and uh, Gary Atkins that time not adhering to that uh, five yards. He's duly penalised, and uh, Lopin uh, kicks up field. Finds touch right on the halfway line. Bernard Dwight to restart play, first man in Evans, but the ball's taken in field. Cooper, on to Paul Farber, round to Cooper again. Over to Vartin, Lockley pass, well taken by Lockley on that far side. Lockley striding up through this job defence. Final pass going up there, and let's go up coming away with it. I thought Lockley had died with the ball, but uh, the pass moved forward. Good enterprising play there, quickly spread out from over here on the right to the speedy uh, left wing partnership of Lachlan and uh, Les Quirk. So it's a scrum down midway between the uh, York 25 and the halfway line. Steve Dobson to feed. So it's penalised, differential penalty in the scrum. Obviously, uh, going in, uh, diving into the uh, scrum formation, the uh, referee crosses indication. So I'd imagine that's uh, Graham Sullivan again to find the added yardage for York. Finds touch just inside the Saints' half. Stuart Horton to restart. On to Dobson, York bring it left. Solid tackling from the Saints, moving up very quickly, stemming the uh, York attack. Paul Vault in that time. Dobson again. Lofty pass over here, loose ball. But it does go back. Carrington couldn't capitalise on it. I think it was uh, Sintilla, yes, Darren Sintilla that came up with the ball. But it's York pressing forward. Jeff Price, strong lad, this uh, right centre. So York now. Steve Bleakley. Just penetrating the Saints half. Hart attacked in half back. York moving it right. Dobson again on to number six, Gary Atkins. Cards a hole in the Saints uh, defence there. The far side touch judge has uh, come on with his uh, flag raised. For what reason? Uh, unknown to us. But uh, I would imagine this will uh, constitute a penalty for York. Suddenly being brought out. Uh, referee uh, Cross bringing out to Bernard Dwyer. Well, obviously something that's uh, gone on in the tattle. <laughs> Allegedly uh, throwing a punch indicated by uh, the referee Cross. So it's another chance for York to get uh, points on the board. We've had 16 minutes play. 16 minutes play, there's no score at present. Uh, York with one that failed a penalty attempt just a few minutes before from about 45 yards, but it was centre field. This is about 10, 15 yards in from the far side uh, stand. And about uh, 25, uh, 25, that's about 35 yards out. Sullivan now stepping up. Looks a bit better this time. Yes, York get uh, the first points on the board. After 17 minutes, a Sullivan goal. Two points to nil in the lead at 17th minute. Uh, Sullivan penalty goal. For Chalk in possession in their own 25. Stuart Harton feeding the ball to the right. Martin and Stuart Evans quickly in there at the tackle. Dobson there trying to get uh, the York backs moving. Taking it blindside, no way through for him. Solid tackling from the Saints. Shane Cooper in there looking to uh, snap the ball out of the York man's hands, but uh, unsuccessful this time. Well, the referee signifying that was the fifth tackle, so uh, York will have to kick up field. Deep kick, well covered by Michael O'Connor. Just goes in field a bit, O'Connor takes it comfortably. Off one foot, comes in field. Taking down ten yards short of the halfway. Les Quirk coming up at acting half-back. 
Going from acting half back. A lot of play now coming from acting half back on, with the uh, one that Marker Rule at the uh, at the play of the ball with Sevens. Turning round, looking to release. Uh, he's just going to release to Bernard Dwyer, but the uh, York tacklers came in. Evans allowed to play the ball. Dwyer takes it left to Tablua. Loop movement with the Cooper. Good tackling from York. They're closing the Saints down very quickly. Not allowing them to move up. Dwyer from acting half-back. Creating space. Looking for support. The ball uh, released. Agatha couldn't take it. Number 10 there. Ian Fletcher drops on it. The York back in possession. Well, I think that's uh, Fletcher I think, playing it to himself and driving upfield. It's a Dobson. Slips a lovely ball, creates a space, slips a lovely ball onto Atkins. Farber and uh, Evans there complete the tackle, but it's York that's at making ground. Obviously nothing to lose, York uh, languishing uh, in the middle of the second division, where the Saints are uh, second from the top of the first division. So York on the defence splitting attack here. But Tony Burke back in uh, defence as uh, Sintela slips the ball in field. Well played by Tony Burke, but coming in for some aggressive treatment there from Ian Wigglesworth. Price in at the tackle. Stuart Evans. Well, York contained the Saints very well at present, not being allowed to move out of their own 25. Haggerty straightens up, gives it to Bernard Dwyer. Sees the York defence coming in, has to take the tackle. Saints will have to stop playing this one man rugby, spread it out uh, quickly to the left. And the ball's back to Michael O'Connor for the kick up field. Try and uh, give the Saints some breathing space. It's taken by Ian Wigglesworth. It's uh, full back for York. Brought down just five yards short of the halfway line. Atkins from acting half back. Going over to the right. But it's York now in possession. Still pegged in their own half. Just uh, penetrating the, the Saints half now. Sorry about uh, some of these posts that uh, keep blocking your vision, but uh, this is the spot we've been allocated and uh, we can't do anything else about it. Back to Dobson. Rubbers for touch, yes. Good kick from Dobson there. Now the Saints defence uh, moving up. Rubbers through and finds touch 10 yards from the Saints line. It's going to constitute a scrum. 10 yards in and 10 yards from the Saints line. Saints feed, Darren Bluer. York just uh, edging on the scrum, 3 to 1. That uh, levels them up now. Less work in field. Just got to penetrate this York defence. Cooper, Lachlan, looking for the gaps. Lachlan, uh, who was man of the match in the Saints uh, final triumph, where they won the John Player Trophy last season. Plenty of pace in the Saints' backs. But York uh, forwards moving in very quickly there. Paul Mulherin and uh, Horton. Cooper, Martin, quick hands there. On to Michael O'Connor, takes it out to Les Quirk. Still going, Les Quirk. Just brought down five yards inside the uh, York half. But the ball's loose. It's uh, come out from the tackle and York uh, capitalised on it. Back in possession. 22 minutes of the first half gone. York winning by two points to nil. Wigglesworth there as York uh, had a couple of man overlap on the left here. Ball knock on there. The Saints capitalised on it. Surely a knock on. The ball coming forward off the York man, but uh, York are back in possession. I don't think the referees wiped the uh, slate clean for the tackle count. York down to 12 men. The man injured there on the floor as the uh, York physio comes on to give attention. It's number eight brought forward Ian Paver. Michael O'Connor takes the ball and he's in goal. Unlucky though, just loses his footing as he approached the 25. And Saints there, uh, unable to get uh, much yardage. York moving up very quickly. Referee Cross looking over to his left. <coughs> Dwyer on the
on to Vorting, coming up face, trying to create that gap. Just uh, unable to create the chink in the York uh, defence. But York penalised her for not allowing uh, Paul Vorting to get up and play the ball. It's a loose forward, uh, Steve Bleakley this time. Saints awarded the penalty. Lachlan kicks up field. I'm sure it's just a matter of uh, Saints. Uh, once, uh, once they score, the floodgates will open. Certainly York are going to try and contain them in this first half. They're not doing a bad job in the first uh, 24 minutes, which have gone. Bluer, left to Cooper. Short ball onto Farber. Ten yards inside the York half now. Bernard Dwyer at dummy half. Cooper tries to kick through. Gathers the ball. Cooper inside to Bernard Dwyer. Inside to Haggerty. Haggerty hurry for the line. But it's on to Bluer. Brilliant try there as Bluer touches down just to the left of the sticks. Quick hands there from the Saints. Haggerty involved in that turn movement. Created a gap. Fed it left and uh, Darren Bluer finished off just to the left of the sticks. So Bluer going over there, his third try for the season with the Saints uh, since his uh, signing from Salford for a reputed uh, 75, 80,000. Well, just saying that I think Corn Saints score the floodgates will open. Well, we've certainly uh, scored the quick hands from the Saints. The uh, speed in the back certainly uh, put it together. Shane Cooper instigated it. He chipped through. He managed to regather the ball. It sat up lovely for him. He fed it left, Haggerty took it on and then uh, Bluer finished off just to the left of the sticks. So it's Lachlan now, surely just a formality for Paul Lachlan. Just to the left of the sticks. Lachlan uh, bangs it over. Lachlan's 31st goal in the league and cup action for Saints this season. Plus one that he scored for Lancashire versus Yorkshire. And the score now, after 25 minutes of this first half, is York 2, Saints 6. <laughs> York kick off, taken by Les Quirk, builds up ahead of steam, drives towards the 25. Solid tackling, Stuart Horton and uh, Ian Paver, I think it is, in there at the tackle. Tony Burke now. Centre field, driving upfield. And the ball back to Paul Lachlan for the kick up field. Much of the play uh, like this in the York, uh, in the uh, rugby league, I should say, with the, the opposition trying to kick up field to contain the opposition in their own 25. Hopefully for the six tackles. But it's York in possession. Brought down midway between their own 25 and the halfway line. Stuart Hart and spreading it over there to the right. Up to York, still keeping it alive. Well, he loses the ball. Saints capitalise on it. Bernard Dwyer onto Paul Farber. Coming cross field, Farber. Well, York were spreading it out there, but uh, one pass too many. The ball uh, went to ground. Bernard Dwyer came up with it. And now with Paul Vartin. Turned round in the tattle, looking to release, but a good uh, clamped, uh, smother tattle from the York outfit. Stop him doing so. Dwyer again on to uh, Tony Burke, it is driving up centre field. Bluer on to Cooper, looking to create space. Back to Darren Bluer, change of direction. Back to Paul Vartin. He straightens up, goes up centre field. Back to where the action started. Dwyer now, Stuart Saints will spread this to the left, quick hand to the left, but uh, Bluer chips through, taking off the ball there. Well, Blake taken down there by uh, Steve Bleakley as uh, Bluer chipped through obviously in the uh, hope to uh, follow his kick up but a vicious tattle there from Bleakley brings him down referee cross saw it, he stopped the play right in front of the sticks uh, where the, uh, the ball landed and uh, was taken by the York player Bluer's had his treatment now Bleakley been uh, duly reprimanded Saints are going to uh, take the penalty goal attempt and uh, as I said before surely just a formality for Paul Lachlan to uh, slot this right between the sticks. <laughs> so Paul 
Carl Loughlin stepping up now, already kicked to one this afternoon. There he goes. No problem for Loughlin, slots it right between the sticks. So after 28 minutes play, two points to York, eight points to the Saints. Silly penalty though, when the Blue tried to kick through, but uh, perhaps uh, Bleakley was thinking better giving two points than six. But he's duly penalised right in front of the sticks, just ten yards out. So York to kick off again. Did well, contained the Saints so for 24 minutes of this uh, first half. Roy Haggerty takes the ball, ten yards from his own line, drives up to the 25. Well, uh, one of York uh, players there being spoken to again, obviously going in uh, with an illegal tackle on uh, Roy Haggerty. Duly reprimanded by a referee cross, so Saints are awarded uh, another penalty. Saints so certainly capitalising on uh, possibly York's uh, frustration. Saints being awarded uh, eight penalties to uh, York's five on my uh, sheet at present. Tony Burke just penetrates the York half. Royer at, uh, acting half back. Stuart Evans coming through from deep, driving into this uh, York forward. Just follow this man, follow the man with the ball. Saints so spending it quickly to the right. Father, half pace! Ten yards inside the York half now. So it's uh, slinging the ball out. Haggerty looking for the gap. Picks it back into to Bluer. Passes it on to uh, Cooper. Inside to Paul Vartin. But keeps the ball alive to Cooper. On to Lachlan. Just unlucky, but he gathers uh, his feet. On to Tony Burke. Just taken down. Since so keeping the ball alive. Keeping it going. Spreading it to the right. Bluer again. Chips through. Only Wigglesworth to beat, but he takes it well. But Carrington comes in, completes the tackle at the second attempt. Well, Carrington not allowed, not, uh, in the referee's opinion, not allowing him to play the ball. Wigglesworth was certainly wiggling in that tackle. And uh, he had to have the second attempt to complete the tackle. He's penalised and uh, York are awarded the penalty. Just bringing back a little of the... Uh, the penalty to York, the six penalties now to York, eight to, to Saints. York fine touch midway between their own 25 and the halfway line. Just about nine minutes of this first half remaining. The score still two points to York, eight points to Saints. Stuart Orton, this uh, ex Castle Veruca, is acting half back. Feeds it back inside, looks like. Uh, Second row forward there, I think, goes uh, Graham Sullivan. But York now, Dobson spreading it right. Back to Dobson. Obviously, play is going to revolve around uh, this little man. Certainly uh, a wiry character. Saints will have to be up to him. York still in possession. Inside the Saints half now. Taking it over to the uh, far, star, far side stand. Ian Paver coming in from deep there, releases it, uh, back pass, York keep the ball alive, Wigglesworth linking up, Bernard Dwyer completes the tackle on uh, Atkins there, Dobson again, change of direction, the ball to Graham Sullivan, but he tries to grub it through, he was coming over to the left, <laughs> but he went through, the ball went to directly into touch, it was on the sixth tackle, so it constitutes the changeover, Farber, Sees the ball after uh, Bernard Dwyer had played it. Saints so just 10 yards uh, outside uh, the York half. Cooper back to Bluer. On to David Tanner. Saints so uh, not running onto this ball as much as we'd like it. They are in the lead by 8 2, but uh, the ball now with Haggerty. Looking to release those onto Michael O'Connor. Well, high tackle there from uh, Darren Sinclair on O'Connor. Going unnoticed by this uh, near side touch judge. He just uh, shakes his head. Shakes his head anymore, I'm sure it will fall off. But it's uh, Saints in possession, Bluer. Grubber in for touch, good kick from Bluer. If it will run, yes, it does so. A fine touch about five yards outside the uh, York 25. So Bluer, good uh, tactical play there from the Saints, pegging York back in their own half. It is uh, York feed. 
Just comes even at two each at uh, present. Dobson to feed, the ball coming out. The York side, it uh, came out at the side of the scrum and it is supposed to uh, come out uh, through the back row forwards. But York keep the ball moving, Wigglesworth, but he runs into Barton, Barton bangs him down. Darren Suntiller, I think that is at uh, acting half back. It is, he goes over there to the right, he is playing on the left wing, but he must be looking for a little bit of action coming in field for play. And it's Stuart Horton now, that's a dummy half. York driving it up centre field, but they lose the ball. Paul Barton, that is, uh, drops on it. It's it, back in possession. Ian Fletcher there having a little uh, disagreement with uh, Stuart Evans. York being penalised for not being the uh, required uh, yardage back from the play of the ball. So Saints awarded a penalty. <coughs> and uh, Saints are duly uh, elect to go for goal. Offside at uh, the play of the ball. Sean Allen coming on there as Sandman for the Saints. Substitute forward for today, Sean Allen. Presently listed, uh, transfer listed with the Saints at uh, £35,000. A good utility player, Sean Allen, played in uh, virtually all the positions for the Saints. I know at uh, Hull uh, last year, the uh, Saints were struggling for a hooker. He was in the uh, hooking role, he's also played second role and uh, in the back division at uh, centre. So it's Paul Lachlan. About uh, 45 yards out, more or less centre field, well within his capabilities. Kick two this afternoon, looks good from here, but it's uh, taken to the right of the post, but uh, Dobson and uh, Horton quickly in there, snuff him out, Dwyer on to Paul Vartin, coming from deep, this uh, Australian and uh, manly loose forward. Haggerty now, all action Haggerty, drives up to the halfway line, but he's brought down by a uh, combination tattler of uh, Bleakley and uh, Mulherin. Finally allowed to play the ball, Dwyer picks it up at the, well it went through Bernard Dwyer's uh, legs, his, uh, his legs there. But uh, referee cross awards uh, a knock on, but... Uh, Saints, well, the ball came out of the back of the Saints scrum. He took one against the head. Blue lost his footing. And uh, Dobson quickly round there and York come up with the ball. Ten yards uh, outside the Saints 25. It's Wigglesworth moving up at the dummy half position. York pressing upfield, looking to get the first try on the uh, board this afternoon. Just one penalty goal to show for the trouble so far. Just about three minutes of this uh, First half remaining, Ian Paver there, and it's uh, Atkins at dummy half. York moving it to the right to change of direction. Straighten up and drive forward, it's the uh, sixth tackle. Dobson with the uh, uh, cross field up and under. Les Quirk takes it comfortably. Turned round, drives towards the 25. But York come up to three man York tackle, forcing back. Plays it to himself. Penalised. Penalised for playing the ball to himself. York come up with a penalty. <laughs> going to go for goal from that uh, infringement. Obviously, York uh, going to have a goal for two points uh, just before the half time whistle. They're uh, trailing by six points at present, eight points to two. Already missed uh, one conversion, uh, one uh, penalty attempt, I should say, this afternoon. A third attempt uh, for. Graham Sullivan. Well, last week at St. Aussie Road, a brilliant team performance uh, by the Saints. Uh, they got it together in the second half against Salford. 30 points to 14, the final score. Two tries from Cooper, one from Dwyer, Farber and Lachlan, and uh, five Paul Lachlan goals. Seal the, uh, the win. Well, a good kick there. From uh, Sullivan. For two minutes, two minutes before the uh, half-time interval, York reduced the deficit. It's now York four, Saints eight. Two Graham Sullivan penalty goals keeping uh, York in uh, the hunt. Well, good deep kicking there from Saints. Took to York 
by surprise. The ball bounced in field and went dead, so York now forced to drop out uh, from between their own sticks and put Saints back on the attack. Just about a minute of normal time remaining. And we don't think we've had any stoppage time, and uh, obviously Saints will want to get uh, further points on the board before the uh, half-time hooter. So there's the dropout. Up to Haggerty, taking on the halfway line. Composes himself, Haggerty drives up for right into the York defence. Solid tattling though, forcing back. Finally allowed to get up and play the ball. Bernard Dwyer takes it left to Stuart Evans. Releases it back to Dwyer. So to keep the ball alive. It's number four there, Chris McElinshaw. First time I've uh, seen him in the action for York this afternoon. Bluer on to Cooper. Chip kick through there, O'Connor comes through. O'Connor sneaking up towards the York line. Good plan moved there from uh, Cooper. He was looking over here to the right, but O'Connor loomed through on the left. So it's taking it left, yes! Bluer, lofty pass out to Farber. Saints keep the ball alive, as you know, I thought Farber was going to pass it. It's the sixth tackle for Saints now, on to Vartin. Crossfield rubber, but uh, cleaned up by Steve Dobson. Taken down on the 25. A solid tackling from the Saints there, Roy Agatin, Bernard Dwyer quickly in at the tackle. Just went down in the tackle and uh, referee cross right on the job. He's bringing somebody out, he's bringing Bernard Dwyer. Well, nothing in that tackle at all, but he's given Bernard Dwyer ten minutes in the sim bin. Didn't look anything in that tackle at all when uh, Dobson came up with the ball, but uh, York have been awarded the penalty. Bernard Dwyer's got ten minutes in the sim bin for his trouble. York could uh, take a quick tap. Take it over there to the far right, St. Janellis. Probably first touch he's had. There's the half time hooter. So that's uh, Wigginton Road. The half time score here is uh, four points to York, eight points to the Saints. A 17th minute Sullivan penalty opened the scoring for York. Then it was 24 minutes before Saints got on the scoreboard. Darren Blue are finishing off a fine movement for the Saints. Converted by Lachlan, six points to two in the Saints' favour. Then a 28th minute Lachlan penalty goal, eight points to two for the Saints. And then Us um, Us Sullivan just uh, finishing off two minutes before the Hooter with an only penalty goal. So it's half time, four points to York, eight points to Saints. With you now at Wigginton Road, uh, York, for the second half of this uh, John Player Trophy. First round, the half time score, eight points to four in Saints' favour. York to kick off. Chris Macklin Shaw there. Kicks the ball deep, taken by Paul Lachlan. Drives upfield. York doing a good job, just containing the Saints to uh, that four point lead in the first half. To uh, Graham Sullivan penalty goals, keeping York in the game. To uh, two Paul Lachlan goals on a Darren Blue a try. Hardly, hardly enough time at uh, half time to uh, finish my soup off, but uh, there we go. The ball back now to Paul Lachlan. Hefty kick upfield, taken by Ian Wigglesworth. Takes it well. Darren Blue goes in for the tattle, but he runs right into Paul Vaulting and uh, Tony Burke, and he's unceremoniously bundled to the ground. Now with uh, Jeff Price. Strong lad, this price, spraying at the left centre today. Back to the half back now, Stuart Horton. Horton on to uh, Steve Dobson. Sits uh, temporarily down to 12 men with uh, Bernard Dwyer being sent off uh, right up on the half time uh, interval. The ball to Dobson, he grubbers through. Michael O'Connor well back there. O'Connor keeps the ball in field but uh, takes it right on his own uh, try line. York defence moving up very quickly. O'Connor takes a little bit of a knock in that tackle. But it's Saints now, trying to clear the ranks. Two or three forward drives to clear the, uh, the danger, hopefully, and then spread it out to the uh, back division. Tremendous 10, 15 yard drive upfield there 
from Stuart Evans for the ball now with Tony Burke coming through. Tremendous pace on this uh, Tony Burke from a standing start. So it's up to the York 25 now, round with Roy Haggerty. Ball action, Haggerty tries to get the ball out to far, but he couldn't take it. The, the ball went loose, uh, York come up with it, but Lachlan completes the tattle. Atkins going over there to the left. Still in possession, just outside the Saints 25. Now with big proppy and Fletcher. But the York keep it alive. So, Sullivan there. Or should I say Sullivan, Graham Sullivan. Linking up. But nothing in that tattle there. Farber. Um, well, Lachlan, I think it was giving extra strength into the tattle. The man's down there with the ball. Referee waves play on. But the uh, York physio comes on. So, under one of the new rulings, the ball is allowed to be uh, played. But uh, the man's all right. York still in possession. Just getting a little bundle centre field. Paver there now. This uh, prop for York. It's the sixth tackle. Stuart Horton tries to chip through. Play the ball uh, ruled. I thought the ball uh, was on the sixth tackle. I don't know what the referee was doing there, but anyway, uh, he ruled to play the ball uh, a changeover on the uh, Saints 25. Tony Burke coming through, solid tackling there. Bleakley, one of the tattlers, and uh, Sullivan. Paul Vartin going from acting half back position, trying to create some space, trying to create a chink in this uh, York defence. Evans flicks it back now to Agate. Can't take it. York come up with the ball. <laughs> Quickly down there was Macklin Shaw, one of uh, York's three Aussies in this uh, side this afternoon. Dobson now. He's a man you've got to watch. You've know, got to get him down at the first attempt. Lively character. Him and uh, Stuart Harden dictating play in this uh, York side. And to prop forward Fletcher. 35 yards from the Saints try line now. York still in possession. On to Bleakley. He gets it out uh, to prop forward uh, Fletcher. So it's uh, reduced to 12 men and the far side touch judge is on for uh, something he's uh, seen in the field of play. the York men being brought out uh, I think allegedly uh, no I thought he was calling to one of the York men but he's penalised uh, Roy Haggerty for uh, throwing a punch in the tattle allegedly as uh, instructed by the far side touch judge that's the one with the yellow flag to pity he uh, hadn't noticed uh, some of the incidents that was going on in the first half when he was over here on our side but this allows uh, Sullivan Another chance uh, to put York back in the game. Saints uh, leading by eight points to four at present. Just five minutes gone of this uh, second half. Sullivan lining up. About 30 yards out. Just uh, ten yards to the left of the sticks. Yes, Sullivan slots it over. So Sullivan definitely keeping York in this game. The score now six points to York, eight points to Saints. Roy Haggerty penalised there. Roy Haggerty protesting vigorously to Steve Cross. And you know Roy Haggerty wouldn't puddle them all over anybody's eyes, would he? It's kick off, York in possession. Tony Burke and uh, Paul Barton in there at the tackle. Just getting uh, outside their own 25 now, York. Dobson switches play over to the right. Prop forward, Fletcher coming through. Brought down midway between the, their own 25 and the halfway line. Back to Dobson. Crossfield, Grubber. 
deep kick. Michael O'Connor's over there, but he couldn't chase it. Good kick from Dobson, as I said before, I'll keep reiterating it's Dobson and uh, Stuart Harton that all this play revolves round. <coughs> Excuse me, they had plenty of room to work there and they certainly uh, made Saints pay for it. It is a scrum down right on the Saints 25, it's a Saints feed, Darren Blue is a feed. Saints come up with the ball, they win the first scrum of the second half. Carrington trying to make his way through, but the ball now with Farber. Straightens up, tries to drive up to the halfway line. Paul Vaulting from acting half-back. Tremendous turn of pace, flicks the ball up to Cooper. Lovely ball from Vaulting onto Cooper. The support a little late in coming up, but it sits on the attack. Just outside the York 25, Bluer, cross to Haggerty. Vaulting again, lofty pass to Lachlan, runs on it well. Still going his ball, Lachlan. Well, a rather aggressive tackling there from uh, number 11, Graham Sullivan. But it sits in possession. Darren Bluer, looking for the opening. Add to Agate. Lovely ball to Cooper. It's knocked by the York man, but Stuart Horton comes up with it. Cooper tried to pass round the man. He did uh, touch the York man, but uh, York come up with the ball. It's now Darren St Hiller. <laughs> this left wing for York. Stuart Horton from uh, acting half back, trying to go on his own, but Barton brings him down. It, Ian Paver coming through at pace, but solid tackling from Agassi and uh, Barton, assisted by uh, Paul Farber. Saints back 3 3 oh, in space there. Well, good movement there from Atkins. He put the York uh, second rower in a hole, a big hole there for him, but he, he lost the ball. It's number 12, Paul Mulherin coming through. Atkins had created the space. Lucky for the Saints, he couldn't take it. We're now nine minutes uh, through the second half, just one change in the score, that fifth minute Sullivan penalty goal. Saints come up with the ball. But uh, from the scrum they lose it. Wigglesworth. Wigglesworth comes up with the ball and now it's York back on the attack. Farber and Evans finally bring him to a halt, right on the halfway. Dobson again. Sharp ball there on to Bleakley. Bleakley again. Um, Dobson again. York moving it quickly to the left. On to Jeff Price. Come into space there. Evades the uh, first tackle of Shane Cooper. But York spreading it quickly to the left. Out there to uh, Darren St Hiller. It's the sixth tackle and York have moved about 50, 60 yards upfield. Dobson now. Crossfield kick. Well, a knock on being ruled, but Saints couldn't take the ball there. It was on the last tackle, so the, the change overruled. Saints back to uh, full compliment now. Bernard Dwyer back on the field after his 10 minutes in the Simbin. And it's Dwyer there from acting halfback. Tremendous uh, run from Dwyer. 10, 15, 20 yard burst there from acting halfback. So it's got to move it quickly to the right. Uh, David Tanner. Carrington on his outside. That's an uh, ex rugby union right wing partnership. Darren Bluer gives the dummy. York uh, stick to the task. Take him down. Don't take the dummy. Bleakley, one of the tattlers in there. O'Connor making the extra man onto Mike Carrington, but a uh, solid tackle there from uh, Darren Santillo. He's bundled into touch over there on the far side, he's Carrington. Once again, uh, wants to scrum down. He's bundled into touch in the tackle. The York man thought it was a change over. Once again, I must uh, emphasise about uh, this the video not being up to the usual standards. We have got uh, a few posts in our way, but it's uh, not of our making. These are the facilities that uh, we've been given and we've just got to make the best of them. I hope you'll bear with us. Well, bl blew it to feed, but uh, before the scrum has uh, formed, York are penalised. 
Cooper kicks up field. The corner taken down, but the uh, referee crosses unmoved. So York back in possession, Dobson. On to this uh, second row, Paul Mulherin. Macklin uh, short, half back. Dobson. Dobson again, York keeping the ball moving. On to Stuart Horton. Unlucky there, Carrington, but the ball still loose. The saddle count waved off. Referee uh, cross. Uh, judging that it's uh, touched a York man. Oh, then the York uh, man touched it, it touched the stage man, I should say. So it's York with another five tattles now. Looks like uh, Ian Paver, this uh, big uh, prop forward for York, bursting through. Tony Burke and uh, David Tanner bring him to ground. Dobson again with a kick through. Michael O'Connor right under it. Walks past one. Tremendous side step off of Connor, feeds inside to Les Quirk. Solid tackling there. Sinjin Ellis going in uh, with an knee at the tackle. But Troy Haggerty now for the Saints. Pushes one off. Looking to release, does so. On to Paul Lachlan. Gives the dummy. Just can't release. Solid tackling from York, but it's Saints back on the attack. Saints have got to make it count now. Spreading it in field. Cooper changes direction. Brings it out to Paul Vartin. Turns round and drives upfield. Keeps it going to Bernard Dwyer. Overlap on the left for Saints, but Tony Burke well tackled there by Macklin, Shaw and Sullivan. Couldn't release it there, uh, Tony Burke. Very unlucky. Loop movement there with uh, Bluer and Cooper, but Stuart Horton uh, sees it. It's the sixth tackle for Saints. Haggerty going for the drop goal. Takes it to the right. Wigglesworth. Comes up with the ball, Cooper stops him. I think that's uh, David Tanner coming in from the far side. Yes, David Tanner completes the tackle. York pegged in their own 25. Ten yards from their own line. Saints have got to hold them out here. Keep them in their own 25 for the uh, remainder of these six tackles. Solid tackling there from the Saints, forcing back. Reminiscent of uh, that try we scored when uh, the opposition were in uh, possession Salford last week. We took them over their own line and scored. Saints certainly G'd up now. Bernard Dwyer urging the forwards there to get in and uh, do this hard tackling stint. Dobson taking it left for York. Not going to let them run. Solid tackling there. Yes, that's the fifth tackle. The last tackle now. York comes to Dobson. Trying to wriggle his way through, but York run it. Just taken down there. Good ankle tap there by uh, Shane Cooper. That constitutes the changeover now. And going in on Paul Walton, but it's Bernard Dwyer attacking halfback. Well, York moving up very quickly. they five yards, I'll eat my hat. But uh, Agassi there in possession. Referee Cross uh, is pointing, but he's not penalising. He's urging them back. Bluer takes it right to Tony Burke. In the York 25 now. Burke still backing up in the tackle. 20 yards from the uh, York line, Saints just with a slender two points uh, lead, eight points to six, Cooper now, out to Forber, tries to push one man off but he's well taken down, Macklin Shaw comes in, Forber plays it to himself, on to Bluer, hoist the up and under, Wigglesworth takes it comfortably, centre field, Cooper completes the tackle, I think it goes Darren Bluer, over there, completes the tackle. But York in possession. 16 minutes of the second half gone. <laughs> York there penalised for uh, not playing the ball correctly. So it's with a chance to uh, widen the gap. Paul Lockling's going to have a go for goal. Beavers now coming on, the Saints uh, a substitute back. Coming on a Sam Man for Paul Lachlan, but Beavers uh, been reduced to uh, the back substitute. He did have a, a groin injury, but uh, there was. Uh, he did. Uh, he didn't get picked for one game, it was Beavers. He dropped down to the substitute position for the, uh, the last two games. Obviously, Alex Murphy fielding an unchanged side. Uh, Paul. Uh, 
uh, Michael O'Connor, I should say, winning the man of the sponsors man of the match award at uh, Nosey Road last week. So he's uh, linking up with the back division. He can uh, read the play from the full back position. He's linking up and certainly got into the game last week. But Lachlan there, he doesn't make any mistake. So 17 minutes into the second half, Lachlan gives Saints a, a little a bit of breathing space, but it's only four points. Just uh, six points to York, ten points to Saints. Well, this uh, near side uh, touch judge one with a red flag, having a few words with uh, the opposition's uh, dugout. Got the ball now with Michael O'Connor. Drives upfield, releases the ball to Bernard Dwyer, straightens up, support on his right, Farber, hard it upfield, Honey Wiggles worth the beat, tremendous run there. From O'Connor, Dwyer and then Farber taking up the running, Quirk, back to Farber again, up centre field, on the opposition's 25 now, good 50, 60 yard break. Dobson there lying on, Saints wanting a quick play of the ball, Cooper now looking for a gap. Gives it out to Bernard Dwyer, looking for support, still stunning the tackle, just finally brought to ground is Bernard Dwyer. So it's got to make it count this time, got to get tries on the board. Barton over the uh, York 25, second row of Sullivan and Mulher and bring him to ground. Bluer, loop movement now with Cooper. Back to Bluer, takes it well, on to Evans, centre field. Well, the last tackle. Drop goal here from Haggerty perhaps, the ball coming back to Haggerty. Centre field, yes. Oh, no, no goal. Well, that's the idea. Try and get points on the board. If you don't think you can uh, get over for a try, come away with something and hopefully get the ball back. It was unsuccessful that time. York to restart with a tap uh, from their own 25. Well, halfway through the second half now, just 10 points to six in Saints' favour. York looking very lively in uh, patches. And it's Graham Sullivan in possession. It's Bleakley out to dummy half, taking it to Dobson, he changes direction. Fletcher coming through at a pace. Lachlan and Quirk try to uh, bundle him into touch. Unsuccessful this time. St. John Ellis uh, coming away from the acting half-back position, but he's going nowhere. Barton and uh, Tony Burke bring him down. But it's York spreading it quickly to the left. Atkins there creates the gap. Gives the dummy, but uh, passes it out to uh, Price, I think it is, on the far side. Good shot, moving upfield, good 40-yard break from them. Lofted pass there, in the tackle. Quirk comes up with the ball, solid tackle from the Saints. After that lofted pass, the York man couldn't take it. He knocked the ball forward, and uh, Quirk came up with it. Forward in possession now for the Saints, right on the halfway line. On to Stuart Evans. Solid forward driving upfield, but uh, St. certainly not took uh, the sting out of this York outfit. On to Roy Haggerty, into space, looking to release, couldn't do so. The sixth tackle now. York moving up very quickly on the referee's right. Cooper chipped through onto O'Connor. Unlucky there, very unlucky, Michael O'Connor. Offside that man there. But he's ruling uh, a changeover from where the, uh, the ball bounced. It's Wigglesworth to restart, onto Dobson, into Ian Paver. Bluer quickly in there with Vartin. Bring him down. Flet Fletcher it is, uh, number 10, prop forward for York. And now York bringing it blindside again, Paver, but Bluer, well, and quite a few. Saints Tattlers go in there and bring him down. Solid tattling from the Saints there. He's a big lad, this paver, and you've got to uh, get him down at the first attempt. York moving it left. Luke moving there with Dobson. York keeping it flowing there. Mulherin. It's all uh, Dobson there. He's, uh, he's the linchpin. He keeps him going. He's there again. He's Dobson. He's grubbing him through, but Carrington takes it with ease. Just loses his footing, but comes back into the field of play. Brought down midway between uh, the stage 25 and the halfway line. Bernard Dwyer going 
Bernard from acting half back position, certainly had a good game in the loose today, Bernard Dwyer. Tony Burke bustling through on the halfway line, looking to uh, slip the ball up there as uh, Stuart Evans loomed up on his right. Dwyer on to Vartin. Powers his way through, still going Vartin! Support on the right, must be a try here. Dwyer going for the line. Is he over? Yes. Well, double movement he's given. I don't know how he makes that, but he, he was nowhere near the action. He looked all he was looking for, and he rules it. Bernard Dwyer, he must have been taken over the, uh, the line there, where he's ruled a double movement, how he can rule that, he didn't know what he was doing, he, uh, he, had a, he, he looked to make his mind up and uh, certainly incurred the wrath of the uh, Saints faithful here. But Vartin there did tremendous speed work from Vartin. But York had awarded the penalty. Tremendous speed work from Vartin, Bernard Dwyer on his right, but uh, York came back. A two-man tackle, but uh, Dwyer was alleged to have made a double movement. Whether you'd see that a bit clearer on the video or not, I don't know. But certainly, uh, points going to begging there for the Saints. York in possession, Dobson again. Sharp ball there, but uh, Barton and Agassi quickly in there. Snuff, snuffed him out there, number 11, uh, Sullivan, certainly a hospital pass there. Well, Dobson rubbers through, Les Quirk couldn't take it. The ball bounced in the field of play and then went into touch. So it puts uh, York back in the... Uh, York back in the Saints half. So it's going to be a scrum down, it's a Saints feed. Darren Bluer to feed. Scrums all level at two apiece uh, in the second half. Well, I don't know how he makes that up feeding. The ball looks as though it's gone uh, right in uh, the centre of that tunnel. But Darren Blue is penalised for feeding. <laughs> York awarded the penalty. It's a differential penalty, so uh, no chance of going for goal. But it's uh, Chris Macklin Shaw. Going to uh, hopefully gain added yardage for the York outfit. Left footed kicker. Finds touch on the Saints 25. York just uh, trailing by four points. Ten points to six to score in Saints' favour. Dobson again onto Bleakley. Stuart Horton. Taking it to Ian Paver. York moving upfield, gaining yardage with every tackle. Certainly Saints can't afford to uh, let a score in for York at this time. But it's Sullivan, takes the ball out to Stuart Horton. Tackling will have to be uh, firm and crisp up there in the Saints 25. York now just about 10 yards from the Saints try line. Dobson again. Well, hospital pass there on to uh, Bleakley. But it's York still in possession. Again, tries to grubber through, but the ball back to uh, Paul Vartin. So Saints uh, a bit relieved now, they're back in possession, although it be uh, 10 yards from uh, their own line. I think it's Paul, Fa Paul Vartin uh, injured there, so the ball uh, under the new ruling as the referee uh, rules the injury is not uh, serious. Passes the, player, the ball on to another Saints player who can restart. Saints driving upfield, Bernard Dwyer, well, uh, rather hefty tattling there from uh, the York outfit. Number 11 there, Sir, uh, Sullivan, Graham Sullivan, certainly getting stuck in, only 14 minutes of the game remaining, and uh, York are penalised uh, for lying up in an offside position, I fancy. So Paul Lachlan... Well, Saints going to make a substitution now with uh, Phil Vivers coming on uh, for Mike Carrington. The substitu um, substitution that was made uh, last week at home at uh, Nosey Road against Salford. So I would imagine Phil Vivers will be reverting to the full-back position. Michael O'Connor onto the right centre and uh, David Tanner will be going onto the right wing. That was the... Uh, the formation after last week's substitution, so I shouldn't imagine there'll be any difference. 
going to dry it out. It's that play onto Tony Burke. Burke driving forwards. Good break from Burke. About 10, 15 yards. Well, lying on in the tattle. Macklin Shaw lying on. Referee cross on move. Evans driving forward. Tremendous sack for taking drive from Evans. Onto Roy Haggerty now. Off one foot. Driving forward. Driving for the line. Support on his left, but Haggerty was taken down. Saints have got to put points on the board now. Barton, short ball, and he goes back to Lachlan. Knock on being ruled. Well, the ball went back, it went behind the Saints. But a, a knock on being ruled. The initial pass, I think it was from Barton, looked a little low, but uh, Saints couldn't capitalise on it. It puts uh, York back with the 75 25, I suppose. Dobson feeding and uh, York come up with the ball from the scrum. Saints will have to contain them down in their own 25 now, moving quickly and uh, make sure, sure the tattling holds firm. Paul Mulherring coming through there at full pace, but uh, Farber and uh, Tony Burke uh, bring him to ground. Bleakly, it's acting half back. Taking it to left or super tattle there. Bernard Dwyer in at the tattle on the uh, paver. Took him back, shook him in his boots there. The ball back now to Dobson. Pick up field. Quirk takes it at the third bounce. He drives up field over the halfway line. Still going, let's quirk. Wire takes it right to Cooper. Locked it past to Paul Lachlan. Off one foot, changes direction. Feeds inside to Stuart Evans. He straightens up, he drives up field. He brought down 10 yards short of the York 25. Well, the referee uh, cross went to his right again. You can see all York moving up, but uh, Roy Haggerty feeds it on to Darren Bluer. But he straightens up, Darren Bluer runs back right into the York forwards. Just 11 minutes of uh, normal time remaining. Barton breaking through. Saints will have to get a try and a goal at least on the board to uh, be in with a chance here. But Michael O'Connor, chip kick through on the last tackle. The ball goes into touch. Bounces in the field of play. Well, York very slow though, couldn't close the Saints down. And uh, O'Connor finally uh, kicks over to the far side. It bounces in field of play. As I said, goes into touch. So scrum 10 yards from the York line. It's going to be a York feed with Dobson to feed. York tidying up uh, 3 to 2 at present on the scrums. That makes it 4 to 2. Similar position now. Saints will have to contain this York outfit in their uh, own 25. Darren Sintelur there, coming through, coming in centre field, looking for a little piece of the action. But it's York now, on to uh, Price. Gary Price, stocky lad, uh, playing it to right centre. Uh, Jeff Price, I should say, playing it to uh, right centre. And it's over there now to uh, Darren Sintelur. He's brought down just on his own 25. Stuart Hartner to acting half-back, on to Dobson. York spreading the ball to the right. Saints quickly in there at the tattle. It's the uh, fifth tattle now. Back to Dobson. Pepper in the Saints with ease. Uh, well, Saints very lax there. Dobson there, they look plenty of space. But to the ball just going in between a uh, Quirk and Beavers. Look very lax there and going into uh, touch in the Saints 25 earlier so it's putting York back on the attack even though it is Saints uh, feed so Darren Bluer well one against the head there York come up with the ball from the scrum so York back on the attack Saints have to uh, come up with uh, another defence Try saving defensive tackle instinct. York moving it left. To Stuart Harton onto Atkins. Cooper has him, his counterpart. Bangs him to ground. Paul Lachlan comes in to assist. Wigglesworth at uh, acting half back position. Going straight on his own. Well, uh, into the forward pass there in that movement. But the ball uh, did go down. A knock on being ruled. Oh. 
Darren Blue to feed and the scrum just uh, five yards inside the Saints 25. Saints come up with the ball, Phil Vivas linking up, takes it over right to David Tanner. Tanner beats the uh, York to win, man. But uh, the defence comes quickly back. Saints have to play it quickly, being impeded. Spread it quickly across me now, the Saints. Haggerty, lofty pass there to Michael O'Connor, linking up, a man on his left. Lachlan, work on his left, Lachlan should score. Can he go over? Yes. Yes, the try's ruled. Lachlan goes over there, he held the ball up well. Quirk was on his left, but he chose to take the tackle and uh, went over for the try in this uh, left-hand corner. Paul Lachlan's second try of the season. Stretches the Saints lead to 14 points to six now. So good play there, Michael O'Connor linking up in the back, uh, in the line from the, uh, well, he's uh, been in the full-back position, but he linked up there. Overlap on his left, Lachlan with Quirk on his outside, but superior strength from Lachlan. Took him over, referee uh, Cross, he had to come over again. Similar to that uh, disallowed try under the sticks. He took his time in uh, having a look before he made his mind up, but he did award the try. So 14 points to six now. Just six minutes uh, from the full-time hooter. So Saints there, hitting back in good style. I was just saying, they're trying a goal on the board and they'll have to uh, put them in a virtually unassailable position, but it's luckily now just about five or ten yards in. No, the ball not coming in field. So 14 points to six. An eight-point cushion. Sean Allen coming on, uh, replacing uh, number 11, Paul Farber, for the last uh, six minutes. Had a good game, Farber, centre field. Got a fresh man on the pack now. And Sean Allen is uh, a forward in his own right. He uh, does like the loose forward berth, but he does play anywhere. In terms of a lot of these search players, they'll uh, play anywhere. We're picked. York kick off deep, Phil Vivas takes it on the full, straightens up, drives upfield, Stuart Orton goes in, uh, a neck eye tattle that brings Vivas down, but it's Saints now, still in possession, driving up centre field, Tony Burke, showed Saints quick, uh, quick break out of their own 25, paid off in a try down here, Stuart Evans bursting through onto Bernard Dwyer, just penetrating the York half now, 14 points to six, uh, Saints in the lead. As I was saying in the first half, I felt sure that just uh, once the Saints had scored, that the floodgates are open. But York have done a, a sterling display today. They've uh, certainly held the Saints and the Saints back. Bluer chip kick through, taken by Dobson. Sean Allen brings him down. The idea was right from Bluer, but uh, Dobson, uh, a wily campaigner. Drops on that ball, Sean Allen came in and completed the tackle, he's there again, Sean Allen with Darren Bluer and Paul Barton. And Stuart Horton. Darren Bluer being penalised for not retiring. So Saints forced to make another substitution now with Shane Cooper coming off sustained uh, a leg injury there. So Mike Carrington comes back on, replacing uh, Shane Cooper. So yet another positional change there as uh, Carrington goes over to the far side. Perhaps uh, Michael O'Connor will take up the uh, standoff uh, duties now with uh, Shane Cooper going off. But it's York in possession, just outside the uh, seat 25. It's Ian Fletcher driving upfield, just about uh, four minutes of the game remaining, and the score 14 points to six uh, in favour of the Saints. Horton left to Dobson, looking for the Louvre movement, but it turns it inside, well picked up by Wigglesworth. Just a hint of luck there in that uh, movement, but uh, it came over to the right and Wigglesworth tidied it up. Yeah. Graham Sullivan going over there to the left in the uh, Saints 25. So Saints having to defend. Oh, and that was. Solid tattle there, Tony Burke going in. The sixth tattle for York. Dobson, well, all on. The ball is in uh, 
Well, they knocked it forward again onto Jeff Price. But all on, surely the uh, referee waved the tattle count off. But very unlucky there. It hit Paul Lachlan and came back to the uh, York player. So it's York on the attack. Bleakley driving towards the Saints line. There's Dobson stepping up for uh, that acting halfback. Looking to get a plan move on here now for, uh, for York. Saints Sattler will have to hold firm. Plan move, centre field, and uh, Jeff Price coming through at pace. But Saints uh, hold out right in front of the uh, Saints sticks. York to play. Swing it right, bleakly. Onto uh, Paver, I think that is coming through. But it's bleakly now coming through. It's the last tattle again of this set of six for York. Dobson. Well, it's a Saints player again. Well, and the referee allowing play to go on. He's awarded another six tattles. So Saints having to uh, an extended uh, defence problem here now. York keen to get a try on the board. They've only three penalty goals to show for their afternoon's work. And the ball well being dragged. That's a knock on. The ball's being dragged towards his man. He's pulled it to, towards him. <laughs> so it's going to be a scrum down about uh, ten yards from the Saints line. It's going to be Saints feed. Darren Blewett to feed. Just a minute of uh, normal time remaining. Plus any uh, stoppage time, which I'm sure we haven't got any uh, uh, much of that. <laughs> The York who can finally get his head in. Darren Bluer feeds. Saints come up with the ball, take it right. Darren Bluer comes up with it, but quickly in there is uh, Paul Mulhead in. Slams uh, Bluer down in the tackle, but uh, Sean Allen comes from acting half back position. Brought down on the uh, Saints 25. Tony Burke takes up the running. York uh, in the league had a great def uh, def defeat of uh, Lee. They beat them uh, 37 points to 18 the other week and uh, Lee at top of the second division. They certainly gives Saints a hard task today. They've held them to 14 points to six. Cup rugby's a different uh, proposition altogether. It's Saints in possession. It's the last title of this set of six and Lachlan picks for touch. The ball going directly in uh, to touch. I think that was on the sixth tackle, so it's going to constitute the changeover. York are going to be uh, in possession now, right on the halfway line. There's the changeover. Well, we're playing in uh, time. Added on uh, four stoppages now. The 40 minutes has gone. 14 points to six uh, in Saints' favour. So I think the result's certainly beyond doubt. York lose the ball, Saints come up with it. A last chance for Saints to get to points on the board. Haggerty, lofty ball to Lachlan, takes it well. Smothered tackle there, Lachlan, he gets it out to Quirk. Goes crossfield Quirk, straightens up. Ten yards inside the York uh, half. Bernard Dwyer takes it right to Stuart Evans, on to Paul Vartin. Feeds the ball onto uh, Sean Allen, but he loses it. York come up with it. There's the final hooter, but as I've just said before, the final result, beyond doubt, Saints come up uh, with a 14 points to 6 win, going the uh, draw for tomorrow's uh, second round draw on uh, the local radio. 17 minutes into the first half before the score was opening, it was a Sullivan penalty goal that put York 2-0 in the lead. A lead they never regained, in the 24th minute Darren Bluer went over for a try, converted by Lachlan, that's 6 points to 2 in the Saints' favour. Then a Lachlan penalty goal two minutes later, that made it eight points to two, and then two minutes before the half-time uh, interval, a Sullivan penalty goal made it eight points to four uh, for the Saints. In the second half, York opened up the scoring again after the fifth minute. It's a Sullivan penalty goal that made it uh, six points to York, eight points to Saints. Then a 17th minute, a Lachlan penalty goal, and then uh, it was at 30 in the 32nd minute before uh, Lachlan went over for a try after Saints had had one uh, disallowed for a double movement. Uh, Earlier on, uh, about five or six 
minutes earlier. So the final score here at Wigginton Road is 14 points to the Saints, 6 points to York. So on behalf of uh, Central League Football Club, Peter Tushingham Photography, your regular cameraman Brian Pears, myself Ron Hoof, I bid you farewell. I hope you'll join us again uh, next week at Weldon Road, Castleford, where we take on uh, Castleford in the uh, league uh, fixture. A game uh, where Castleford took a point off us at Nosey Road. I'm sure Saints will want to get back uh, in winning ways and uh, hopefully uh, get a win at Weldon Road.
win this mercantile credit centenary trophy from the chairman of the Football League, Mr Carter, and that trophy is being passed down to all the different players in the team right the way through, and the players will get their <coughs> memento of this game, and all the team have done so well this evening to play and keep the Mercantile Centenary Trophy here in England, and that will go in the Everton Trophy Room. <laughs> and now the West Germans, Bayern Munich, and they're being led up by Lothar Matthaus to receive their trophies. Are the mementos of this game and <laughs> And well, as all the presentations are over now, the officials, the referee, the substitute referee, Mr. N. Midgley from Bolton. Uh, referee Mr J.B. Worrell and the two linesmen, Mr Millage and Mr Morgan, will get their trophies. So, from Goodison Park, where Everton have won this Mercantile Credit Centenary Trophy, beating Bayern Munich, the Bundesliga champions, by three goals to one. Sharp two and Heath one against the one goal for Bayern Munich by, uh, by Hughes, the ex-Manchester United player and Welsh international. So from Goodison Park, it's good night.